Peggy 18. We'll find her, I promise. Whether it's here or at the edge of the goddamn world. We'll get them. We'll get them all. All right, folks. Welcome to Inversion 101. This is Rich, Filthy Rich Bantegi from Namco Bandai Games, Community Manager. And this is Ken Ma. I'm producer on Inversion. Right, so right here today we're going to talk about a bunch of really cool things. Inversion is a new game that we have coming out. Ken, fill them in on what's going on in Inversion. Inversion is a third-person shooter allowing you to command gravity. It comes in three different ways, and the first one is actually called the Gravlink. The Gravlink actually allows you to have two different settings, and it allows you to command gravity in two different ways. So the first way is actually called low gravity. So because we're a cover shooter, when you're playing the cover shooting game, there's going to be that enemy that's hiding behind that box and you can't quite shoot. He's going to keep popping his head up and waving at you, trying to say hi. And instead of trying to shoot him, what you can do is you can use the gravity device to actually lower gravity. And this will allow you to shoot a blast of gravity that's concentrated in a small area. It'll actually boost him up above cover and it'll allow you to get an easy shot on him. The Gravelink also allows you to use high gravity. So this is actually the exact opposite. This will allow you to shoot a blast of gravity that actually increases the weight on objects and enemies. So for example, if I shoot this guy with heavy gravity, he's actually going to be pinned to the ground. He's going to be struggling. You can see him try to fight and try to fight, but there's too much weight on him. It's essentially doubling, tripling, quadrupling his weight. Here's another really cool thing, and that's the destructive environments that are included in the world of inversion. For example, there might be a sniper tower. Instead of trying to take them out traditionally with your gun, what you can do is you can look around your environment and use your graveling device to pick up all these various objects. And you never know, try throwing any of these objects at this tower and you might be able to bring the entire structure down and make the battle a lot easier. Now, Inversion also features what we call vector shifts. Vector shifts are what we use to really keep the player on their toes when we're kind of flipping the environment back and forth. So in Inversion, enemies can actually come at you from the ceilings and they can come at you from the wall. We got a bunch of really cool things to share with you, strategies, gameplays, everything that you need to know about Inversion. So stay tuned, and this is Inversion 101. We'll see you guys later. Yeah.